What's up, y'all? I want to see a show of hands and find out how many people here in elementary school was made to read the book, It's Just a Plant. How many of y'all was forced to read that book? I'm going to give you a synopsis of the book. Um, it starts off with the main character, uh, the protagonist. His name is Max. Max is a caterpillar, okay? And he's really naive. He's, uh, you know, he's green around the edges. He's just coming to the world. And he didn't have any guidance. He didn't have a mother butterfly or anybody to show him the ropes. So he had to learn as he went. Um, he forms a strong bond with another caterpillar. Can't remember what his name is, all right? Just bear with me. Um, makes a best friend with this other caterpillar. At that point in time, they start moving around and everything, and they're living their little lives, and then they start eating leaves, all right? And while they're eating the leaves, Max winds up eating marijuana leaves. Yeah, it's a children's book too, mind you. So Max starts eating uh, marijuana leaves while his friend doesn't. He gets hooked on the shit. His eyes are getting all bloodshot and everything. And his friend is telling him, don't eat the leaves, don't eat the leaves, blah, 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 blah. So time comes when the two caterpillars have to get into their cocoons so they can, you know, go through their metamorphosis into butterflies. Um, and mind you, they're monarch uh, caterpillars turning into monarch butterflies. So, you know, it, a little time passes while they're in the cocoons and everything. And next thing you know... They break out. His friend breaks out first of his cocoon, and he's beautiful. Um, you know, he has all his coloring and everything, and all his designs. Wings are all even. You know, just all nice and pretty and beautiful. And then you have Max pop out his goddamn cocoon, looking like a fucking alien butterfly. His wings are all broken and tilted and can't fly. Um, his eyes are even more bloodshot, you know, different parts of his body are, uh, misshapen and mis- and, uh, misformed. And, lo and behold, the whole, I guess the whole point of the story was that don't use marijuana when you get older. So, I was just wondering if any of y'all had ever heard of that book, or if it was just a Baltimore special. Because, when they had us read that book, I had no idea of what marijuana was. Um, I didn't even, I had never even thought about using marijuana. I mean, I, I'm in elementary school. I mean, I'm talking third grade they had us reading this book. And they had us read this, this damn book and I'm just wondering, you know, what is that? I'm thinking everything green is marijuana. You know, if he eats leaves, I know the spinach is leaves, so I can't eat spinach. I'm, I'm gonna grow up and get all fucked up. You know, what's gonna happen to me? And I just always wanted that. And I just always thought it was so fucked up that they would have children, young children, read this book. And uh, I don't know if it was just at my school or other schools, and maybe this was across the country was being pushed. But they had us read this book, and it just had me really confused about, you know, marijuana and eating leaves and feeling sad for this helpless butterfly who can't fly away to find his food and to migrate and find a, you know, a spouse. And, you know, only thing it did to me was make me feel depressed. You know, and I'm a child and I shouldn't have been feeling depressed, you know. What the fuck? But, you know, I just want to show hands how many of y'all were forced to read that book and let me know how y'all it made y'all feel. Um, especially if you were young, a young child. Uh, being made to read that book. Um, I found another video on YouTube about it, and uh, and uh, I'm gonna link that on here so you can see some other stuff about it. You know, maybe it'll jumpstart your memory. I, I'm just always wondering, and I'm curious. All right, so yeah. Like always, comment, rate, subscribe. Didn't want to forget to throw that in there. Um, all, you know, I always like comments and discussion, you know, I respond to you and everything. So just let me know uh, what you felt about that.